Very nicely done. So, uh, take us over that match in the finals there. Uh, we were talking a lot about, uh, you know, gut shots and vapors now specifically being very good against some of the cards and draws that Craig could present and also very being very poor against some of the other things he could potentially be doing. We saw you uh, gut shot as champion of the parish in one of the post board games. Yeah. So, take us over sort of your sideboarding for the matchup and how much were you worried about uh, champion of the parish and like hero of blade hold. Like I was really worried about um, lingering souls, and he had uh, the instant speed put two tokens into play. Uh, card midnight too. hunting, yeah. Yeah, midnight hunting. <laughs> Get out of here, Jesse. <laughs> yeah, okay. He's the guy who gave me the deck. So yep. <laughs> yeah. Jesse Hampton. Um, yeah. yeah. So it came down to uh, yeah, lingering souls and uh, and midnight hunting. I just really wanted to like be able to protect my delvers, and even if I was cracking into them, I could just keep it around if he double blocked for whatever reason. But and champion too, yeah. But I was pretty cold to uh, hero. Yeah, I felt. Well, I mean, the the deck is pretty naturally set up to be pretty good against hero between like snag, mana leak, um, and snapcaster for the rebuys. So like the we were talking like the four mana sorcery speed doesn't impact the board. Kind of plays are sort of the things you're actually hoping to play against. Uh, obviously, hero has its moments. Like if you tap out for. Guys, and he answers with hero, and you don't have an answer to the game. And also, I saw this open. in his board, and I wasn't sure the angelic destiny, and I wasn't sure if he was bringing those in against me. Yeah, but and maybe vapor snake would be good there. We'll obviously be crazy, but, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, but um, yeah, and the other thing I was worried about was uh, sorry, the damn, where was it? Oh, um, the. Did I already say Hero Blade Hold? Yes. Oh, okay, mentioned. yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that was like the main thing that I was worried about, so. So, um, how did your matches like play out over the course of the day? Were there any matchups you were particularly trying to avoid, or was everything... I was actually, I just got up? the deck today. I actually haven't played it that much. I tested it a little bit on Friday, but um, I figured like that new, the Brian Kibler deck, you know, the... The, the Naya pod deck. Sort yeah. of pod-ish deck, I thought yeah. that would be like a bad matchup, but I beat it in the quarters, I think. Yes. And that was the only match I... The only time I played it, and then... Managed to just play red green aggro, which seemed not too bad. Mm -hmm. And um, I played the mirror a few times. And I played blue black control three times too, which was like, I thought that was gonna be a really bad matchup, but it was like a buy almost. Right. Yeah. I mean the the counter spells plus snapcaster like plus like a good really, clock. Really is quick just, threats is just. They have all really these crazy. five and six mana spells in their hands, yeah. so it's really hard to to play efficiently. And uh, celestial purge was like an all star all day too. Yeah. Like every matchup that came in, and it was crazy. You get any, you tag any curses with it? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I got a grave titan with it. it was, sure. Yeah, it was awesome. So have you played in a lot of the open series before? Or I've only played in two opens. I played in the Seattle one like a few years back, the original Seattle one. Yeah. And I top that one too randomly, but that's like pretty much the only two Star sure. City opens I played in. So are you gonna make? A, are you gonna show up to the Invitational in Indy? I don't know when is that. It's in June. June 16th. June 16th. June 16th. You have your choice, actually, of any of the invitations throughout the year, and there will be one on the West Coast. We haven't okay, if there's one on the West Coast, then I'll go, because I'm from Vancouver, so it's a little far, you know? We, it's 16 hours to get here. Uh, Vancouver, Washington, or Vancouver, Canada? Canada. Oh, okay, yeah. cool. We had cool. a GP coming up, which is pretty lucky. Yeah, you'll but. probably see me up there. I got a lot okay, of friends cool, up there. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but uh, again, well... We got lots of dinosaur pros up there. Yeah, oh, Jeff yeah. Jeff Cunningham. Yeah, Jeff is one of the... Fung. One of Jeff Fung, one of yeah. the... Cunningham's one of my all-time favorites, so yeah. Yeah, he, he's a class act. Yeah, for sure. All right, well, again, congratulations. Thanks. Brandon Cryptic. Am I pronouncing that last name? Please? Yeah, you're actually right. doing it right. Thanks. Brandon Cryptic, you're uh, Gotta go get Salt Lake dinner. champion. Yeah, I, I'm going to be right behind you trying to get something to eat.